Welcome to Swayze Field here in Oxford, Mississippi. We've got a midweek matchup for you on the SEC Network as Alcorn State meets nationally ranked Ole Miss. He pitched number 20 with no outs. Lined in the left, a base hit. And Rembert drives in the first run of the day. Check swing, ball four. And Garcia will trot home, and it's 2-0 Alcorn State. Taylor Broadway is the new pitcher for Ole Miss. Of the first baseman. Line in the left, a base hit. Rembert scores, Cole will score as well. Teen on the year so far. Make it four for 14, and Broadway with three strikeouts, Matt. And for the maturity in their team after a big win. That's a great swing right there. It sure was, and it's going to leave the ballpark. How about Knox LaPasser with a home run, and the Rebels are on the board. That's how you get your first hit of the season, Knox. Back-to-back -back curve balls, slurves, whatever you want to call it. That one left over the middle of the plate. LaPasser does exactly what you're supposed to do, wait back on it. Rebels now four for four on the base path. And there's a base hit into right field by Servidio. And the steal a second by Ely pays off. And the Rebels have cut it to four to two. Down one nothing to a dangerous hitter. A roller to short. Servidio to Chatigny. The relay is low. Nice scoop by Ooh. Baker. Base hit. Keenan launches one. Wow. Another home run for Ole Miss. And the Rebels are within one. <laughs> that was a no doubter. I mean, oh. he shows bunt in the first pitch. And uh, the third baseman's kind of smiling, like, you're not really going to drop one down. And of course he's not, because he's going to hit a bomb over in the student section. The right fielder did not move one lineup before having an injury that really sidestepped his whole season. Fly ball into short right field. Coming on and making the catch is Rembert. They're going to try to score the runner, Graham, and he will slide in safely. Benji Gilbert is the new pitcher for Ole Miss as we head to the top of the fourth, tied at four. From an error to Baker to a base hit. And Garcia now three for three. It's going to be an RBI single to left center as McGowan scores, and the sacrifice bunt works to perfection. Last year, that's the eighth most in a single season. And he just got tied up for strike three. The corners, one out. And they're going to try to get two. The throw to second. The relay is in time on a bang-bang play. And Mike Bianco is coming out to see what they call. Safe at second. Safe at first. We go to the top of the six, tied at five, and Mike Bianco has gone to his bullpen yet one more time. This time it is Logan Savelle. We're at 5-5 here in the top of the sixth. And a strikeout, and that will end the inning. Three, a couple strikeouts and a fielder's choice, showing Bunt pulling the trigger back, and Ely has stolen third. That one gets away, and Ely will score. A couple strikeouts and a walk today. He lifts one into right field. Rembert will make the catch. Servidio should have no problem scoring, and he will standing up. He redshirted a year ago. That one is hit deep to right center field, and this one is going to be gone. Austin Miller is the new pitcher for Ole Miss here in the top of the seventh in a one-run game. And look what just happened. Cole has tied this game at seven. Roller back up the middle. That's Servidio to his left. And a one, two, three, top of the eighth for Austin Miller. A bouncer up the middle, a base hit for Elko. Chatigny will score from second, and the Rebels have the lead in the bottom of the eighth, thanks to Tim Elko. It is Braden Forsyth from just down the road in Coldwater, Mississippi, here at 471. Squibber is going to be let a tough go. play. Will they let it try to roll foul? They will, and it will stay oh, wow. fair right on the line, and we're going to be tied. 
Grounder to the right side. Chatagne makes the play on Garcia here in Oxford. Servidio hitting a smooth 500 on the year, sends one deep to right field. Back to the wall, it's out of here! A walk-off for Anthony Servidio, and the Rebels win it in the most dramatic fashion, 9-8. Drop and drive, lift and separate, Anthony Servidio driving one out to right field to put his team ahead in a big midweek uh, scare. We will wrap things up from Swayze Field here in Oxford. So from our partner, Matt McLaughlin. And the rest of our outstanding SEC Network crew, I'm Will Colmeyer saying so long from Oxford. The final score once again, Ole Miss wins it on the Anthony Servideos walk-off home run, 9-8. to eight.